Hello my darlings, it's so nice to have you back here in my kitchen. Today's menu, we're going to be making some delicious baked turkey drumsticks. As you can see, it looks so so delicious and I thought why not show you guys how I make mine. darlings it's so nice to have you back here in my kitchen let's jump straight into this recipe so i got these gorgeous turkey drumsticks from sainsbury's this morning and i thought you know what let's bake that up so i cleaned it and then i went in with a little drop of oil some salt a little bit of parsley as well as some garlic and pepper seasoning followed by some paprika and then i'm also going to go in with some of my spice jamaica regular blend seasoning you can substitute this for some all-purpose seasoning and then you want to go in with some of my homemade green seasoning the link is down below in the description box for my green seasoning so you can check it out and then i'm gonna rub that in i'm gonna massage that in i did create some slits in the turkey just so that the seasoning can go all the way in and oh my goodness guys just know this is gonna be packed with flavor make sure to rub the seasonings in on both sides and again check the description box for all of the seasonings that i'm using today once it's all done it should look something like this absolutely gorgeous do you see how flavorful it actually looks like a leg of lamb as well <laughs> so i'm gonna go ahead and let that marinate and then when it was time i covered it up with some foil and then i'm gonna pop it into my oven to bake for about two and a half hours undisturbed guys i know it's hard it's gonna make your whole house smell amazing but don't interfere with this right pop it in and then you want to come back and check on it after two and a half hours and it should look something like this full of sauce gravy then you want to just baste it okay baste it with these beautiful juices and you want to pop it back into bake uncovered for about half an hour or more so it can take some color and yes my darlings this is literally the easiest way to make your turkey drumsticks After about half an hour uncovered in my oven, this is how it looks. Do you see the color on top? Gonna go ahead and baste it with those remaining juices. And then I'm gonna garnish with some fresh parsley. As you know, this is literally the finishing touch on mostly all of my meals. But guys, do you see how beautiful this looks? Oh my gosh, it looks so delicious, so juicy. Look at how it's falling apart. You could actually use this to do some shredded turkey in some tacos. Or you can just throw this in some bread or a bake or something. But oh my gosh, it was so, so delicious. I really hope you enjoy the recipe. It's been a pleasure having you here. And I can't wait to see you in my next one. Don't forget to purchase my new cookbook, Bomaje. Bomaje translates to good food in St. Lucian Creole and this cookbook is basically a little taste of St. Lucian and Caribbean cuisine. It's packed with recipes, packed I mean 50 plus, but all these lovely recipes, gorgeous. And you can click the link down below in the description box if you'd like to purchase my book. And guys, once again, thank you so much for all of your support, to all of you who've been purchasing my book, to all of you who have it already. Honestly, I'm so, so grateful. Thank you so much for watching and I can't wait to see you in my next video. Bye!